Hello everybody and welcome back to Last Day on Earth Survival. It's been, yeah, it's been probably about two weeks since I posted my last video. However, because of all the coronavirus stuff, my work has now been shut down, which sucks because obviously the whole not being paid as much. I think they've now come to an agreement that they'll pay us 80% week by week instead of the full 100% we should have got. But whatever is what it is. It only means that I am now stuck in isolation, quarantined, alone in my flat until they lift the lockdown. Which is a shame, but means I have been driving myself insane, playing a lot of games. It was sunny today. I went outside. I liked it. I only sat in the garden. Right, so we're going to be going raiding. And we have done everything apart from five airdrops. We've got three more to go, but I haven't had any pop up. And we're down to 157 coins! It's getting close. I can't remember the last time I had this few. I've just been, yeah, not using them. Right, got everything we need. We have our lovely snowmobile bike chopper thing, mini tank looking creation. Now, I apologize if the audio is slightly out of sync or if it just sounds weird. So for some reason, the program I used to record my screen with has decided it doesn't want to record my mic properly. It makes me sound like Batman in 8-bit. It sounds awful. However, the program I use to edit my videos also has an audio recording function. So I'm recording my microphone in a separate program to the game. And we'll just see how it goes. Right, we are going to raid player 5928. 5928, 5928. Z base however you want to say it, and my Facebook is going off because I'm in a group chat and I forgot to mute it. That was rather silly of me. There we go, where's the game gone? Ta-da! Right, 5928, please have something good for me, because I don't want this to be a disappointing base raid video right now. Hey, we've got the small storage box there, so zombies aren't going to come through. And we might as well just break this one open. I've, wait, how is it still beeping? I've closed Facebook. And my phone is in, on silent. It shouldn't be doing that. That's illegal. Alright, let's just break through. I'm expecting honeycomb. Oh, no. But I did literally smash through the only spot where I won't be able to get through again. No, don't do that. If I haven't said before, I hate this game sometimes. There we go. Right, it's not the most advanced base I've ever raided. No, don't break that. No, come on game. Just let me smash. No, don't break that. I love raiding, it's so fun. On the upside, there is not very much here, so it doesn't look like we've wasted a load of noise. So I think even if, yeah, okay, so the zombies are spawning around the edge. They should be all running to me now. Here we go. And if we dip back in, we can get round to the windows and we can kill basically everything, I think. So if I go close enough to a window, I think they start running at me? Yeah. And then I'll just back away and they'll stand still again. Wonderful! Which means I can actually evade the big one, however, looking at the rest of this base. I don't think we're even going to get to 100 noise, even if that room is completely full of boxes. Which I hope it is. There we go, Zomball's dead. Right, I'm literally just going to go around and smash down one of these walls because I can't get in on the other side. And my knee is hurting so much. I went for a run last night and I've just buggered up my knee. Literally to the point where I was walking upstairs earlier because I went down to get the post. Because people still send posts. Okay, Amazon sends posts. I bought a fuse. My lamp died. Side note, sorry, going off on a tangent here. So, my lamp died not long after I moved in, and I finally got a new fuse for it delivered today. Put the new fuse in, turn the light on. The light was on for about a minute, and then the fuse was blown again. Like, what? Luckily, I've got a pack of about six fuses, but that means I have six minutes of light from my lamp. And I like that lamp, it's one of the nice old fancy ones. 
I say old and fancy. It's just... I don't know. I like it. I think it looks nice. What was I talking about? Oh yeah, hurt my knee, so I went downstairs. By the time trying to get back up the stairs, I literally had to stop halfway because it was hurting so much. And then finally realised when I had about two steps to go that I could just lead with the other foot and I would be completely fine. I don't know why I'm taking limestone. I do not need any of that. And what are we going to get in here? Hey, there we go. We made it to 100 noise. I actually had to fight the big one earlier. I say fight the big one. So I was doing one of the Raiders tasks and I had to kill 52 Mike at the <clears throat> limestone spires. And as soon as I got there, big one turned up. I was running away from him. And 52 Mike was there. So I had to tango with a big one. I think I used about 38 med kits and two sets of armor. And I did something like 40 damage to the big one. But I killed 52 Mike. Hey, so which one is this? Sir Synthrax, what's up, mate? Oh, also, to everybody watching, this video is mainly here because Plubex, Plubex, however you say your name, kept messaging me and asking me when I was going to post a video. And I kept saying I was going to do it today. And then I just kept not getting around to it. And then he nudged me again. So yeah, thank you, Plubex. You have brought this video into creation. I might just kill him all. Bang, 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 bang. Beautiful. Now I should be able to open two of them before the zombies turn up. Oh, here they come. But luckily, I open boxes fast. And they are only roaming zombies. This is the best place. If you've got the shotgun spread shot, it's just so satisfying. Lining them all up and smacking them with that. You just go boom and they all die. Uh, Kaboka Bay. What have I got stuck in my head? Is that can fly? I think that's can fly with me. Go on, don't do it. Hey. Oh, that was all my armor done. Done? That was a mix of done and gone. That's all my armor broken. Rest in peace, me. So, how is everybody finding season six so far? I am actually pleasantly surprised with it and enjoying it. So I'll show you where I am up to. We are level 22. So I've just gotten the gas cylinder and if we scroll up here there's one more cylinder to go and one transmission. And reputation wise I have completed Chuck and I have completed Harry. Not sure if I'm really going to focus Vivian and Stranger too much because you don't really get anything that good. I'll probably focus Stranger just so I can get the backpack skin. I won't use the backpack skin but it's there and I'm a collector and I think I thought we already had the leopard skin underwear from somewhere else but I might be wrong about that. Not sure but I just mainly want this one for these spices is this something new? And the caps. Oh my god, I need so many caps. So, I have used about 60,000. 60,000? Caps at the petrol station, gas station, lottery machine to get ATV transmissions. I have gotten one. I've gotten one transmission from it. I keep looking at my webcam because I've spent the last two days basically just constantly in a video call with everyone from work that's also not working. It's been quite fun actually. I've rather enjoyed it. Right. Raiders, would you like a single engine part? Yes, you would. Wonderful. Have I got any... Oh, I should probably put some stuff in here for a revenge raid. And you can have that as well. That should be enough. Food, 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 food. None. Awesome. No, you're not allowed to die. I'll be back with you in a second, everybody. I hate the noises in this game sometimes. There you go, you patient little sod. So I have got some blue spotty underwear on. Aren't I beautiful? So, my next video is going to be... My final ever Bunker Bravo run. Until 
they add some form of upgrading the ATV and require you to use bits for it. But, if you weren't already aware, the ATV only has four slots. What? This! This massive thing with this entire storage compartment, apparently this storage compartment, which literally I could fit in, is only four slots. And that makes absolutely no sense, so I'm hoping the devs will listen to feedback and increase the default slot size for the ATV. Or just let it be an upgradable feature, so you can upgrade the slots to, I don't know, 16? I think 16 would be good. Double what the chopper has. But look, I'm so close. I literally just need two gas cylinders. And because I've got the unlocking doors completed in Bravo, I get two cylinders every single time. Plus the one from the season pass as well. So I only need to bug Bravo once. But it's the bloody transmissions. So after the end of the season, I will still need two more ATV transmissions. And there's absolutely nothing I can do to guarantee I will get them. As I said, I've used 60,000 caps. I literally cannot afford to complete the ATV. It's ridiculous. Right, let's call the Raiders back quickly. See what task... Oh, hello, dealer. I might go and have a trade with you. A single woodworking bench. You know what? I can do that. Because, hopefully, you are going to have an offer of will you please go and do some deals with the dealer. And if you do, I will then consent to giving him a woodworking bench. Do you like my little corgis? Not sure why I've got the corgis there. Okay, you want me to... Raise three puppies, I could do that. Uh, find two engines. Uh, that's gonna be difficult. Let's see if I can take that out of my inventory. Three deals with the dealer. Called it. Right, as for the f one of the tasks at least, which was mature three dogs. I'm sure, there we go. Piper, uh, Yoda, and who are you? Teddy. Boom. And that's why I never mature my dogs. So when you get a t that task, they're just all ready to go. And boom. That one's done already. Was that key kill three bulls at the farm? Yeah. Right then. Unfortunately, not going to be able to get all of this done for this video, as I would like to try and get this posted today. And at the time of recording, it is 7.54pm GMT. Greenwich Mean Time. Although I'm not sure if Daylight Saving Time has an effect on that. Either way, I am going to end off the video here. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll be seeing you next video for my final ever Bunker Bravo run, which will probably be time-lapse with music over it, as well as another raid. So thank you for watching, everybody. I appreciate you all. Wash your hands. Stay safe. Don't go outside. Play last day enough. Goodbye.